Welcome back. Made it to Syndicate. This station is uh, four jumps from the high sec and six jumps from Faction Warfare frontline system. So it's pretty much the best you can get in terms of logistics. All services that I need are in this station. So cloning, repairs, uh, reprocessing, industry, so everything that I want, everything is available on the station. And I built a writing catalyst. Look at this. Yeah, isn't it beautiful? Actually had to mine in a venture in high sec for like an hour because I didn't have enough uh, titanium uh, to build the blasters and uh, max tops and the ship itself. The replacement ship, I should say. I had uh, one of them from a career agents, but I needed another one for salvaging and stuff. And I needed to build the, the ammo as well. Uh, I didn't have enough antimatter to do anything. Uh, but with that out of the way, it deals like 200 DPS, and that is with um, an expert system that I have available right now. And as you can see, I still need to train for like three days before I will be able to reach the same numbers without expert system. Uh, okay, after I moved here, I cleared all the belts once, just to see if it's enough to do a belt writing in Ulsec. And it was enough, it was a little bit more challenging than I expected. Um, like in some spawns, when there are like five rats, it can be a bit tricky. Uh, the damage is pretty, pretty high, and uh, it actually takes a bit of time to kill uh, high-level battleship rats in this, but it's doable. And uh, the income is obviously significantly higher than, uh, than in high sec. So it looks like, looks like it works. And um, like on literally on the very first belt, I killed a convoy that dropped like 6 million of titanium which is a very nice thing, because as far as I understand, titanium is actually a bottleneck if you decide to do what I do. Uh, so getting like 6 million of titanium pretty much solve, solves this issue for a very long time. And uh, the rest of the minerals that uh, you see on the screen, I got from reprocessing stuff that uh, dropped from the belt rights. But as I said, this is literally like seven belts or something like this. Um, I keep everything that I may need in the future, which is uh, uh, drone damage mods, meta guns, uh, meta miners maybe, meta reps, meta scrums and all kinds of stuff like this. Drones as well. Perhaps I won't need to build them at all, I just keep uh, saving them from the, from the, from the drops. Uh, okay, my next goal is um, this Algas, uh, or rather a tech 1 variation of this Algas. I think overprop destroyers are very, very strong in the situation that I'm in. They're not uh, committal, they're very slippery. We don't really require a ton of skill points, uh, neither in navigation, nor in reps, or in guns, or anything like that. So I believe um, the tech 1 variation of this fit is good enough. I can, I can replace uh, guns with, uh, with tech 1 or meta, I can replace a point with tech 1, I can replace damage control and uh, DDA with tech 1s as well, or a meta and it will be almost as good as uh, the Tech 2 variation, which is basically what I want. Uh, there are two tricky parts in this feed for me. One is the bulkheads. Uh, I need salvage to build them, and it's a pretty specific salvage, and I'm not sure if Serpentis rats will drop them. I did a very little bit of salvaging just to see what's going on. 
and uh, I didn't get I, I did get two the required components dropped so I guess I can farm them just by salvaging wrecks but I didn't get um, alloyed bar or something like this that's also required to build um, the rigs so I don't know if I actually drop from the wrecks that I have available or if I have to move to a different region just to farm this specific uh, uh, this specific type of uh, type of salvage to build these tech one rigs. Uh, we will see. I didn't have really enough time or ammo. As you can see, I'm completely out of ammo uh, to do any serious belt rating. So we will see if it actually drops or if I need to do something about it. And the second tricky part is uh, drones. Um, I really need tech two drones for this fit to work, and I actually need Omega for hammerheads. But we will see about that. And obviously, I cannot build them; it's too complicated for a refresh character. So I will need to loot them in one of the faction warfare hot zones. As far as I know, it's not very difficult. There are plenty of drones that people leave behind. I just need uh, like a scanning ship and the combat props and I should be able to get them but that's uh, like a second uh, problem that I have that I will need to deal with separately and as for the hull and uh, everything else I can build it pretty much right now uh, just I need to buy the original blueprints and I have I think plenty of minerals already to build uh, everything I want uh, but I won't gonna do it, gonna, gonna do it now because uh, the main problems are rigs and drones and once I get rigs and drones when I can uh, uh, when I can just build the ship itself and everything else so it probably will take like two or three days two or three additional days to get uh, everything set up uh, in terms of like finding drones, building rigs, but I think it's okay. I'm not really in a hurry considering how horrible my skills are and I probably will need like a good four or five days before this uh, ship will be competitive in PvP anyways. For example, I still need to train drone ships, uh, drone skills uh, to use like five drones uh, and it's and it's like five days away I think uh, so I think it's okay all right I will keep you updated uh, on these uh, like small separate goals for now like I'm here and uh, when I have something ready to show I will make another video until then thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one